Purdue at Maryland. And the Terps are a three-point favorite, of course, latest number over at BetUS. Uh, this is 12 p.m. Eastern Time game on the Big Ten Network. And I'm I'm really intrigued in this one. I want to know what to expect from these teams. Uh, going to pull up the stats here. Uh, of course, going to tell you the trends. Maryland 4-0 against the spread in their last four. Uh, of course, that's this season. Uh, but they are 2-5 and against the spread in their last seven at home. Uh, Purdue is 10-4 and against the spread in their last 14 against teams with a winning record. They, they tend to show up in these spots, and they did it last week with a win over Minnesota. I was a little surprised to see Purdue, after a big win in Minneapolis, come out as a dog at Maryland. However, this Maryland team has been impressive. You see a bunch of green on that screen, right? Green means good, red means bad. So I I look at this, and I, I, I'll i tell you this. I, I like Jeff Brom quite a bit. I don't trust Mike Loxley yet. I know that the offense is good, right? I mean, they're number 10 in field position. Uh, they've got a big advantage there. Uh, number 24 in points per scoring opportunity. They are... Uh, However, they're number 106 in scoring opportunities per game, and part of that has to do with their explosive rate, right? Uh, They are number 41 in passing explosiveness. Uh, They're number 59 in PPA per pass, number 34 in PPA per rush. Uh, But I like this this defense from Purdue. Like, they're number four in defensive PPA per drive. They find ways to stop people. Uh, Their offense has not been great. Uh, obviously, it hurts when you didn't have O'Connell out there, and he was hurt last week. So the offense couldn't do everything that they wanted to do. But the defense stood up to Minnesota. Uh, why wouldn't they be able to do the same thing here? So I don't necessarily trust Loxley. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to take Purdue to cover the three here. I think they can win the game outright. Uh, so I will certainly take the three here. Uh, which, by the way, these are not my official plays. The official plays are over at the BetUS College Football Show. Make sure that you go and check that out. Tuesdays and Wednesdays, we knock those out. Uh, Subscribe to that channel. We're almost at 10,000 over there. Uh, If you're not subscribed over here, go ahead and subscribe over here as well because that helps out a ton for both of them. Uh, And the show, I mean this show, Winning Cures Everything, is brought to you by BetUS. So make sure that you check that out. So uh, moving right along. Oh, yeah, Purdue to cover the three. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.